this is all weird and shit. I should actually fix that. Yeah, I'm gonna fix that. This is already matched up. I'll just extend the video as long as I need to. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, so, I don't know how well you can see my headphone- my head- my headphones. My hair. <laughs> but, my headphones are gonna push it down a bit. Not the front of it though, but yeah, I was thinking just, like, you know, if you can see my hair well enough, yeah, I'll try to brighten it up a bit. But, uh, yeah. Uh, I'm Static X. What's up? <laughs> no, I'm not. But still. Uh, yeah, it's all good. I just wanted to fix some stuff up. Alright, here we go. Seven minutes in so far, and we started. And then we had to wait for that. So, two, three, four, five, six, seven, about five, five, six minutes. So, I gotta get an hour and five minutes in. Here we go. Itchy, 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 itch. Ooh. The itchy itch was rich in itch. And it felt real good to itch the itch. You know, I've been thinking. I, I like Balloons Tower Defense. I'm at level 90. I know other people are way higher. They just play that game a lot. And I'm at level 90, and I really enjoy that game. I've been thinking about doing videos on it, but I don't know if I'd make good content because, you know, there I wouldn't be saying much. I'd be like, okay, I'm going to do this. I'd be essentially kind of narrating it, and it's just, I don't know. I don't know. It wouldn't be funny. I might I might put something up about that game. I don't know. It's just a thought in my mind. But, as I said, we are going to go to Vermeer now. I cannot wait to get to Mass Effect 3. I cannot wait. I want to get to Mass Effect 3. I, I really want to. I'm excited about this. I'm really, I really am. Especially with what I have planned for the end of Mass Effect 3. For the Citadel DLC, specifically. But especially with what I have planned. With what I have planned, ooh, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be spicy. It's gonna be interesting. I'm gonna need to keep my composure about me, as I said before. Things are gonna get weird. Interesting. Amazing. I'm I might it might it might be it might be boring, honestly. I have no idea. But I need to keep in mind stuff. So Yes. Here we go. We are now... What am I doing? It's good, I was stupid actually, and I left that. I didn't, I honestly didn't mean to, I was just gonna go straight there, but I wanted to check, never mind. Apparently I didn't, apparently I left, and now here we are. I uh, just wanted to check this, see if there was anything left, and no, there is nothing left. So now we are gonna go for real. Okay, here we go. Now I'm doing it correctly. All right, Vermeer. Pock Vermeer. Blah. Vermeer. All right. My hair, man. My hair. <laughs> Seriously. I was like, eh, you know what, I usually, you know, give it a little style and stuff. And this was, you know, just part of it. I needed to make it go up so I could just do the rest of the style. But, you know, I decided to go, you know what, why not? Screw it. And then, you know, I went for this. Alright. So. Uh, jar for no, we're going to Vermeer. Vermeer. Itchy, 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 itch. Do, 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 do. So who do I choose? Who do I choose? Who do I choose? Pretty interesting question if I do say so myself. We're gonna be fighting synthetics. So I would say that I choose Garrus and Tally for all the synthetic enemies. Commander, I'm reading a signal. Must be our Solarian Alright. Check out those defense towers. 
Drop the Mako. We'll go in hot and take them out. Yep. I'll get you we in will. underneath their radar, Commander. That's gonna take some time. That might take a good 10 to 20 minutes. This whole part right here, but I don't know. Drop, Commander. Don't get cocky. No, I like Joker. I'm not gonna do that. Good job. Stay Says out of the range. same you thing either way, but... Until I bring those AA towers down. I know the drill. Meet you at the camp once those towers just the illusion of choice, but you see this, how it's all standing up? It's all dumb. It really is, because, you know, it's just like there as a placement or whatever. It's like, eh. But then when you get it, actually get into it, watch what happens. See? It goes lop, and it does that, and then when you get out of it, you get out. You see? It's normal now. It's not elongated and trying to stand itself up. So, you know. Just wanted to point that out there. Okay, we got a lot of enemies on the radar. And then we got these things. They're supposed to be living creatures, but I don't think they're living creatures. I don't know what they are. They don't look like any li thing living. They look like some robotic things. Honestly, I'm sorry, dude. I almost killed you. That was amazing. I didn't expect to dodge so well. I could have I uh, could have ended up killing him. All right, here these guys are. Get out. All right, we're going to kill these guys on foot to get more XP. Not that it really matters, I mean... I already got to level 50, it's not gonna, I'm not gonna get much higher. Even if I do, it's, I already got my bonuses for the second game, so it really doesn't matter. I could just go through this just blasting them. You know what? Why not? I'm just gonna blast them with the Mako. I have been not, I haven't been using the Mako for any other enemies, you know? But, yeah. Taking quite the damage. Hi, dude. Bye, dude. Hi, dude. Bye, dude. All right, they're done. Moving on to these guys. I'm sorry, dude. I killed one of the alien guys. Oh no. All right. Hi. Bye. I'm liquid. I'm liquid geth. Liquid geth. Wouldn't that just be liquid metal? What about the componentry, though? How would that look? I don't know. Never liquidified any com uh, computer components or wires or anything, so... Alright, so we're gonna zoom, and he's gonna die. And I'm gonna get hit with a weapon. All done. Thank you for your cooperation of death. I can take some attacks. Bye. Oh, come on. Hi, 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 come on. Alright, you're dead. Bye. Oh, okay, this is pretty simple. It would have taken longer if I uh, didn't do it this way. Oh no, I ran him over! I'm a horrible person, now I'm gonna be arrested! No, I'm not. Uh, I just... I wasn't trying to. And it doesn't really matter if you kill those guys anyway, I mean, really, did anyone really care? I don't think anyone did. Uh, but I did. So, yeah, whatever, I don't know. Oh, yeah, nice textures not loading up. Uh, do I have any better armor? Did I ever get any better? Oh, no! I gotta talk to the other guy. I know what to do here now. I can't, I can't collect anything. I totally forgot to go to the... Um, um, guy again to sell my stuff. So, eh. It is what it is. So I gotta go and just sell my crap. Uh, but first I gotta decide who I'm taking on that mission when that comes to fruition. So, what I think will be happening is, uh, uh I'll decide as the as time goes on, what I'm gonna do. Um, mm. 
I really want to know now who I'm gonna bring, who I'm gonna take. Who am I gonna take? Ooh, yeah, I'm gonna take uh, Rex and. Uh, yeah, I'll take Rex and Garrus. So that, you know, I don't die. And they can take care of a lot of enemies for me. Why did I open this? I can't take anything out of it. Uh, Alright, did, did we open the gates? Did we do the thing? If we had to have, there's nothing to press. Unless the game just bugged out. I don't even need to do this place. I don't even need to get out and kill these guys. It was already open. What am I doing? What am I thinking? I'm not even... I don't even know what's happening. I can't... I'm not even... I could have just bypassed this whole thing. I wasted some time. I'm dumb. I mean, we're already almost 15 minutes in. Man, I could have been further. I could have been almost there. Oh, hi, big dude. Nope. Aww, oh, you dumb. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Come on. No, you don't. You don't. You don't. Oh, he's all spread out. I think I bugged him. Oh my god, he's bugged. Oh! If I took that hit, I would have been taking damage. Okay, yeah, he's bugged right now. His legs are all messed up. Oh, yep, they're messing up. Big time. I'm gonna mess him up again. Hi, buddy. I ran over you. Did I fix his legs? No, I didn't. Ooh, damn. Uh, I gotta turn around, you know? I'm almost out of shields. And he's dead. I need to sit here and recharge my shields. It's not good. This is really not good. Oh, yeah, I'm already getting hit from that far away. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. I thought I was going to get hit. Ooh. Killed it. Oh, I almost took that shot. I almost took that shot. I almost ate that shot and hit my vehicle. Slowly, but surely, it is recharging. Alright. So, um, yeah, I'll see you when it's actually fully recharged again. I'll just, uh, turn and sit off in this corner. Or I'll turn around and sit off in this corner where the wheel's gonna fall into the dirt. It did in the PC version as well. Yep, see, like I told you, right here, it's like their code is messed up or something. You can see the. See? Just slides off into the dirt. Uh, oh no, come on, back up. That area. No! It's, it just wants to go forward by itself. There it is. No! Here. There you go. No. Yep, it's doing forward by itself. I have control for the most part, but it's no, it's it's like stick drift or some shit. I'm pretty sure it's stick drift. A lot of people complain about that. And yeah, I've never experienced it, but I'm experiencing it now. Here we go. There we go. I got it to actually stay. I mean, it's not a big problem. I mean, I played throughout this whole thing without really ha having it be a problem. It really isn't. Uh, I just... Is there a dead zone on this game? Usually most games have a dead zone thing. Uh, Xbox controller. Hopefully there's a... No, there isn't. Uh, the other game probably has a dead zone. Camera sensitivity, horizontal combat, vertical combat. Oh, it's only camera sensitivity. Exploration and combat. So, 100 and combat. 
I'll have them at 70. You know, I'll take these down one peg, and yeah, I'll leave that, uh, no, save selections and exit. Uh, that was unexpected to go through here and do that, but while I'm in here, it's, uh, the, my shields aren't charging, which means I'm wasting time. Uh, pointless. Why are you giving me any of this? Now I gotta sit here and just go through all of it, and just, oh my god. There, are we done now? Squad. My squad's points. My squad. I keep doing that. Alright. We're almost halfway there. Almost. So, how was your day? Mine uh, was pretty uneventful, like usual. But I still had a good time. You know, drinking some Mountain Dew here, the stereotypical five year old drink of game players when it's just a drink and it's just like an energy drink you know it's essentially an energy drink I mean it's just high caffeine shit I, I like it but it's not really that great hell almost any other soda is better for you it might only be slightly better but it's still better not as what I'm trying to say is it's not as bad it's still bad for you it's not better for you it's just not as bad for you it's not you know this is worse than those other sodas all right mm -hmm. yeah I don't know what else to say you know um, I'm looking around Trying to find something to talk about. And I've got nothing. I could read, you know. I've got through part of this book. I'm actually on part two. There's like three parts to here, as you can see, and, you know. I'll show you in a second here. I'll open it. And uh, as you can see, uh, see part two. Uh, yeah. Right there, part two on this book and it's a pretty good book in my opinion I mean uh, some people say it was dumb and it was just hor horrible but I also got um, pull it out this book and this book was amazing I really enjoyed this book a lot of people did uh, they're saying oh this book was great so I thought this book was gonna be great one kid was talking about that on, on a video and uh, oh it's almost charged but uh, on a video and he's like oh so I thought this book was gonna be great because this book was great which I should read this again, actually. Uh, but... Are there parts to this? Yes, there are. Uh, but... Let me see. I'm trying to get to that other part. Yeah, there it is. See, part two. Just like the other book. Uh, but this came out first, and this... Oh my god, yes, I have read all of this. I think I read it one and a half times. Or twice. Once or twice. Uh, I definitely have read this once, and it was, oh my god, it's not as thick as the other one, but it was an awesome book. That's why I got the other one, but yeah. Uh, the 11th Plague. Awesome book. I uh, don't read much either. I don't read much at all. I mean, so. There's that, but... Yeah, this book is good so far, in my opinion. I mean, I never read it, and I got this a long time ago. Should have read it by now, but as I said, I don't really read at all. Because I don't care for reading, I don't care for sitting there just reading. But, yeah, it's quite a good book, it's quite nice, and I am gonna finish reading it. Just not right now, on my own time. Um, and... Well, I could start doing book reviews, but I don't think I will. I don't think I will. But yeah, that was something to talk about while this recharged, and it's fully recharged now. So uh, yeah, I'll speed this up by two times, so I'll be speaking really fast. And if you uh, want to hear this in a clearer way, just go down to the cogwheel in the um, uh, YouTube settings and switch it down to 0.5. Uh, so you're going at half speed, because I'm going to be doubling the speed of this. And if you're going at half speed, it'll go back down to normal speed, so you know. Just do that for this section, and you'll be good. So, uh, I could have just cut this part out, and I could have just, you know, made this video not as long. 
because I sat here doing nothing. I'm pretty stupid. Well, anyway, it is what it is. We're moving on, and this is going to take two episodes now. Uh, I was hoping for it to, like, to maybe take one, one and a half episodes. Uh, but apparently not. Apparently I get hit anyways. And you dead. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I dodged them both. I, was, I thought I was going to get hit by one of them, but I didn't. Oh, I didn't see that coming until it was almost too late. No. Hit me anyway. Now you're gonna die. You were gonna die anyway. So I don't know why I say now you're gonna die and get all upset about it. Uh, there's two of the big guys. I'm gonna kill both of the big guys. And then they'll both be dead and I'll win. Uh, I did that too early and uh, I should have got hit by that, but I didn't. And now we're going to hear a message from our sponsors. You didn't hear that because it was too low. I could have gotten up and uh, pointed it at the mic, but I didn't. Uh, I'm not telling you what it was. I was going to tell you what it was, but you don't need to know that because uh, I know what I'm going to get for it. I'm sorry, but it's what happened, and only I know what really happened. You can speculate, but you don't know the truth. I'm pretty sure you do, though. Especially for me saying I could have got up and pointed it towards the mic. I'm so stupid. It seems like I'm really stretching out these videos longer than they should be, you know? Uh, but hey, yeah. Turn, turn around every now and then I get a little bit blah 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 blah. I don't know the rest of the words. here oh well, what's over there oh well, that's over there okay so, am I going around in circles oh no I'm not am I what is going on oh there it is yeah like I said oh no Oh, I did that too early. Now I'm going to get hit and lose my... Damn it. Okay, I'm done. I'm out. I'm out. I got to wait for the shields to recharge again. This time, I'm going to skip it. I'm going to skip it this time. My shields are done. Done, 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 done. My shields are done, done, done. Yeah. Ha, ha. Very funny. 29. 32, 29, 33, 29, 34, 29, 35, 29, 36, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46. Well, with what I cut out, it's, that's not going to be correct for you. Spatially, you're not even going to hear this. My hair, man. My hair. And my knees. Could be some delectable content coming in the future from this. I already had some content come out from this. But, uh, I lost the footage and I already did it. So I decided just not to redo it all over again because I already experienced it after a while of not experiencing it. And I haven't experienced that. So I could go to the second one to finish that second one. But, but it's this. It's a... This. doesn't work well to too well it uh it gives me audio and everything but yeah i use a different port for all the other audio i pass it through and do some weird crap to it because uh it doesn't come out through both ports it only comes out through i think the left side could be the right but it only comes out through one ear 
because there's something faulty about this. But I do get visual and uh, so that's all I really need out of it, honestly. I could pass the audio through the optical port on the PS3, and uh, I think it, I think the PS2 actually has another port for audio as well, so I could do that, you know. But it does work. And that's what I need it for, because the capture card only uses HDMI. So, my shields are halfway. Yeah. Actually, I want to see. Platinum hits, I haven't really, you know, played this much. That is awesome. You know what's really cool? This is a really, really old game. And it's kind of neat that Best Buy does this, but you know. They sell these games brand new for 20 bucks. This is a really old game, Midnight Club LA. And look at this. I mean, look at that. Take a look at that for yourself. That is really, really clean. Hell, you're even seeing my recording and what I'm doing. See? All my recording software right there. And it's all uh, going. Yeah. That's how I'm getting all the videos. I'm using Elgato, as you can see. Uh, the game capture, uh, HD60 Pro, I believe. And, yep, there that all is. But this is, like, uh, really, really clean. I haven't used it much, honestly. I could play some of this, too. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I know I'm going to eventually, when I can, I don't have good enough internet yet. When I can, I'm going to stream, but... I could stream some of this too. Wow, I'm getting a bunch of new ideas that I could do, you know. Just some casual stuff. Like this, th some of this stuff is just some casual stuff like Horizon and this. Uh, some of the stuff I do really, I want to stream because I like, I really like it and everything like that. This is just some casual stuff that I like. And uh, yeah, I'm going to stream kind of casually. It's going to be like a laid back stream rather than a like this video where this is like a video I want to do and I'm just like I'm getting it like that instead of being a more like oh this is fun yeah and I'm not really saying much I'm just enjoying it and you're enjoying it with me but this is something oh I mean it's something I really want to do it's one of these real videos man the real shit all right so it's charged and I guess I didn't skip it this time either and it, it really didn't take that long from last time. It's only been about, what, five minutes and I... Oh, wow. This is going pretty good. All right. So. Let's go uh, take this guy out now. Um, I get hit again? Am I just dumb? Do I not know how to dodge anything? Alright, you're dead, man. 720. I got 720 XP. 720 P XP, no. This is in 1080. There's our target, Commander. Oh, yeah, nice. You got blasted, man. And you got dead. There must be a way to shut that gun down. There is, and we're gonna do it really quickly. We're gonna blast through all these guys because they can't do anything to us, and uh, yeah, that'll be that. So, uh, yeah. My barrier, uh, die. Oh, I thought he would die in one shot, and I thought I wouldn't feel like I had bugs on me. I've been dealing with an ant problem here recently. Not in my room anymore because, you know, I took them out, but you know, around my house. Uh, we got most of them away. But, you know, they keep trying to come back, and they're very persistent. So, yeah. It's really annoying. Haven't been bit, surprisingly. But, yeah, it's quite uh, bad. This infestation, I mean. But still, we, we got them, like, cleared away pretty quickly. It didn't take too too long, so, you know. I'm reading that the grid is down, Commander. I want to approach the Solarian base now. Yep. Now. Ready to continue. Why do you have to call me Commander Shepard specifically? I mean, are you too dumb to call me by my real name? 
kind of are because you know the game's only programmed to know you by Shepard. So that's fine. It's not a big deal. I never had a problem with that. I just pointed that out because you know I'm doing a video because I'm stupid. Never pointed that out before, but I thought about it. You know, and I'm shooting at nothing. Nice. Bye. All right, we're out. And we're gonna go around. Please don't get stuck on the Mako. They're gonna get stuck on the Mako, at least one of them. Alright, no. Alright, good. That's surprising. My shields will protect me just fine. Here, one of you will die, like you. can you just shoot for once and take him out? He's kind of, like, hurting me, you know? Thank you. I, I took quite a bit of damage because he was hitting me. Apparently, you guys don't want to help or care. How about I destroy you? You know, I'm a biotic and tech person. I can just shoot you and destroy you. Are you ready? Huh. That's the third time I shot you. Yay, we're finally at the camp, and we're over halfway through this video. It, that took way too long to get to the camp. I am a very sad, sad person. Over here. Over here, over here, through in here, down in here, up in here, and wiggle, 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 jiggle. Wiggle, jiggle, you see the tires wiggling and jiggling, and I'm not moving as fast because of what I'm doing. Commander, Normandy's touched down at the base, but it looks like we're grounded. The Solarian captain can explain when you get here. Okay. Okay, well, deal with it when I get there. Have to go with the flow. I mean, I don't know what's happening or why he grounded us, but yeah. Gotta take care of that. So, yeah, here we are. I can see the camp ahead, up ahead. There go the Solarians. Alright, yeah, I know. Alright, let's see what's going on here. So, what are we supposed to do now? Oh, nice textures. Stay put until we can come up with a plan. Hmm. Uh, what's going on? Are you in charge here? What's the situation? Yeah. I'm Captain Kirahi, 3rd Infiltration Regiment, STG. You and your crew have just landed in the middle of a hot zone. Every AA gun within 10 miles has been alerted to your presence. Great. Are you kidding? That's just great. What now? Exactly. We stay put until the Council sends the reinforcements we requested. We are the reinforcements. What? You're all yeah. you sent? I told the Council to send a fleet. The message was unclear. Uh, sorry, they're not coming. We couldn't understand your transmission. They sent me to investigate. Yeah. That is a repetition of our task. I lost half my men investigating this place. So what have you found? Saren's base of operations. He set up a research facility here, but it's crawling with Geth and very well fortified. That's not good. Uh, what kind of research? What's Saren researching? He's using the facility to breed an army of Krogan. How is that possible? Exactly. Apparently, Saren has discovered a cure for the genophage. <laughs> Great. The Geth are bad enough, but a Krogan army, he'd be almost unstoppable. Exactly my thoughts. We must ensure that this facility and its secrets are destroyed. Destroyed? I don't think so. Our people are dying. This cure can save them. If that cure leaves this planet, the Krogan will become unstoppable. Yeah. We can't make the same mistake again. We are not a mistake. Is he going to be a problem? We already have enough angry Krogan to deal with. He'll listen to me. He'll be fine. I'll talk to him. Yeah. I'd appreciate that, Commander. My men and I need to rethink our plan of attack. Can you give us some time? I understand. Go ahead, Captain. I'll come back soon. Mm-hmm. We won't be long, Commander. In All the right. meantime, if you need any supplies, you can talk to Commander Rentola. That's where He's I need to go. He's in one of the tents nearby. That's where I need to go. I need to sell Looks all like my stuff. Looks like things are a bit of a mess. Yeah. Yeah. I wouldn't be so worried if it wasn't for Rex. 
He looks like he's gonna blow a gasket. You think I should go talk, talk to, him? to him? It wouldn't hurt. Well, it might, actually. Just do it carefully. <sighs> be ready. I'll be careful, but be ready, just in case. I'm always ready. I've seen what she does, and it's horrible. I was so distraught when I first saw that. I mean, it wasn't even, it was like maybe half a year, year ago or whatever. Um, I didn't even, I think I, yeah, I didn't even see it myself, like, playing the game. I saw it off somewhere else. I'm like, or, or no, I did see it. Okay, that, that was Rex, but I did see it playing the game. But I was playing the game, and I was trying to save him and everything, but I was like, I had to load, but I was like... I was all like, what? No! It was horrible the way she killed him. And I got all upset at her and, you know, did that stuff. But, Greetings, okay, Commander human. Rentola. I am Commander Rentola. I can provide you with supplies for the upcoming mission. For anything else, I suggest you... That shotgun is Kirby. awfully loud for being this far away from him. Uh, you can't have much. You just tell me what you have available. We have limited reserves. Yeah. We requested a fleet to destroy Saren's base. Instead, they sent you. Your request never came through. We'll just have to make do. Yeah. That much is clear. Let me see what you have. What little there is. Yep. Uh, unique item, unique item, unique item. And then we're going to go to sell. And now it's going to be a little while. I don't know how long this is going to take, but this will be sped up. keep one of the armors, but I totally forgot about that, so, you know. I'm keeping very little things. I was gonna sell it all, all, but I'm keeping very little things. Do, do. Uh, medical Ectoskeleton IX. Ooh, okay. So, I'll keep these few things, but here we go. Here. Tally could use it, but uh, I'm not. I'm not taking Tally with me. I want to give it to Garrus then. And uh, what do I have installed here? High explosive X is better. And now I'm going to see Hello about again, his human. supplies. If you need supplies, I suggest you take them now. Let me see what you have. I know. What little there is. We're on the final leg. It all comes down to this. Salt, Light Armor Turian. How does it compare? Not to me. To his. I'm pretty sure his is better though. Or wait a minute. Uh, I'm gonna check this. It's easy decryption. Douche, douche, adouche, 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 adouche. Can you give me better armor, please? Um, apparently not. Oh, why are you so loud, Rex? Why are you so loud? Okay. I'm gonna go talk to him. This isn't right, Shepard. If there's a cure for the genophage, we can't destroy it. I understand. Calm down, Rex. I'm not the enemy here. Saren's the one you should be mad at. Yes. Really? Saren created a cure for my people. I will you load if this does not work it. out. I will Help load. Help me out here, Shepard. I the lines will between friend load. and foe are getting a little blurry from where I stand. You know, I always had that thing where things happen, it already happened, that is what it is. Uh, 
and I should be taking that here to heart as well, but come on. Um, it's not that simple. This isn't a cure, it's a weapon. And if Saren is allowed to use it, you won't be around to reap the benefits. None of us will. Nope. That's a chance we should be willing to take. This is the fate of my entire people we're talking about. I've been loyal to you so far. Hell, you did more for me than my family ever did. But if I'm going to keep following you, I need to know we're doing it for the right reasons. Rex, these Krogan are not your people. They're slaves of Saren. Tools. Is that what you want for them? Yeah. No. We were tools for the Council once. To thank us for wiping out the Rachni, they neutered us all. I doubt Saren will be as generous. All right, Shepard. You've made your point. I don't like this, but I trust you enough to follow your lead. Just one thing. When we find Saren, I want his head. Agreed. Now, that, the way I did that, uh, usually you have to use a Paragon or Renegade option. But, if you get his armor, do his loyalty mission for his armor, his family armor, then you can do it without Paragon or Renegade points. And there's actually an achievement for that, at least on the 360. I don't know if it's the same on the PC, if there's an achievement on the PC for it, but it's that way on the 360. Uh, checking in here. Oh, I can decrypt the communications relay for some reason. I don't know what it'll give me, but hey. Uh, XP. Great. Yeah. I was. Because I'm that good. Your ability to calm the Krogan No, I'm not. I just, you know. I, I know how to do it. I've done it before. You know, I didn't have to load. Happened. Yes, he did. It won't be an easy fight, but we're ready when you are. Nice work with Rex. I didn't think anything would calm him down. Normally I wouldn't think much of Solarians in a firefight, but these soldiers seem well trained. Well, yeah, almost any soldier is pretty well trained, or at least decently trained. Yep, we all do. Especially with what he's trying to bring forth to fruition. Thank you for speaking with the Krogan. The assault on Saren's base will be difficult enough as it is. I assume that means you've got a plan? I assume that means you've come up with a plan. Of sorts. We can convert our ship's drive system into a 20 kiloton ordnance. Crude, but effective. Nice. Drop that nuke from orbit, and Saren can kiss his Turian ass goodbye. Unfortunately, the facility is too well fortified for that. We'll need to place the bomb at a precise location. Sounds difficult. Where do we take the nuke? And how do we get there? The bomb must be taken to the far side of the facility. Your ship can drop it off, but we'll need to infiltrate the base, disable the AA guns, and pacify any ground forces first. You want us to go in on foot? We don't have enough men. <sighs> He's right. It does sound a bit risky. Is there no other way? No, but I think we can work around that. I'm going to divide my men into three teams and hit the front of the facility. While we've got their attention, you can sneak your shadow team in the back. You'll all be killed, though. It's a good idea, but your people are gonna get slaughtered. We're tougher than we look, Commander. But it's true. I don't expect many of us will make it out alive. And that makes what I'm going to ask even more difficult. I need one of your men to accompany me. To help coordinate the teams. That's a bold request. You expect me to commit one of my people to your command? We are all soldiers by trade. If your people are not prepared to face such a risk, would you really want them by your side? He's right, Commander. We can't do this without both teams at their best. I volunteer. Not so fast, LT. Commander Shepard will need you to arm the nuke. I'll go with the Solarians. I got an opinion with about this. I'll tell you in a second. Gunnery Chief, it's not your place to decide. Why is it that whenever someone says, with all due respect, they really mean kiss my ass? No, I gotta agree with her there. It's really true. When someone says, oh, with all due respect, or with this, or with that, and they're trying to be nice about it, but they really mean, uh, screw off. Give it to me, blah, 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 blah. They really mean that. They're just trying to be nice about it. It's a, it's a nice way of, of being mean, essentially, of having an argument or whatever. But anyway, with my opinion here, uh, what I usually do here, and I do it all the time ever since I've realized this, 
But um, uh, she is right that Caden is better suited to arm the nuke. He's more technical. He has more technical expertise. Hell, he's always working on the thing in Normandy. And she's more suited for a combat role. So it would be better to place her commanding the team with him and him to go with the bomb. So, Captain, who do you Who would be better suited to the mission? Either of these two will do, Commander. Both seem willing to sacrifice their lives if necessary, though if we are lucky, such sacrifices won't be required. Take Ash. Williams, you'll accompany the Captain. No heroics, understood? Aye, aye, Commander. I will have the ordinance loaded onto the Normandy and brief your crew on its detonation sequencing. Do you have any questions before we go, Commander? Your exit plan? The Normandy's picking me up. How will your teams escape the blast? We will engage the Geth as long as possible. Once the bomb is in place, we will fall I'm back to try to and you. escape the blast radius. If we move yeah, quickly, I'm we should be able to escape to quite intensely. casualties. If not, then our memories I've never will had these problems, to literally. Cause. Sounds dangerous. You talk like this is a suicide mission. I won't lie to you, Commander. There is a chance none of us will survive this assault, even your team. But we do what is necessary. Yep, that they do. That they do. Uh, other teams? Shadow seems clear enough. What will the other teams be called? Eigor, Manovai, and Jeto. They were the initial settlements on our first three colony worlds. They are at the heart of Salarian territory to this day. These names will remind my men what they are fighting for. They must have a personal stake in the fight if we are to have any chance of success. Trying to boost morale. Give me a quick rundown of the plan again. You are Team Shadow. We will create a distraction while you infiltrate the base. Make your way to the breeding grounds at the heart of the facility. Disable the AA gun so the Normandy can land and deliver the nuke. If we get that far, we'll try to help you with guns, but don't count on it. Once you have the bomb, place it next to the geothermal taps. Then get out before it detonates. All right. I want to know more about the bomb. How reliable is it going to be? Its reliability depends on the person arming it, but it will do the job. The drive system is highly impervious to damage from external sources. Once it has been armed, very little can stop it. The key is getting it into place and armed before the Geth can stop us. And that's where the difficulty comes in. All right, let's go. I'm ready when you are, Captain. Excellent. Then if you'll excuse me, I need to prepare my men. Very well. Well, this is it. Don't do anything stupid while I'm gone, LT. You too, Commander. We'll be fine. You'll see. I yeah, think we I already just... know what I'm doing here. If you've watched the other videos up until this point, we all know what I'm doing here. Or most of us, at least. And, uh... Yeah. What is it? Is there something you want to say, Chief? Yeah. I, I don't know. It's just weird. Going under someone else's command. I've got used to working with you. All of you. Don't worry. We'll see you on the other side. I know. I... It's been an honor serving with you, Commander. It doesn't matter if we're not in the same unit. We're still a team. Watch each other's backs, keep your eyes open, and fight like I know you can. We'll all come out of this in one piece. You bet, Commander. Mm-hmm. You all know the mission and what is at stake. I have come to trust each of you with my life. But I have also heard murmurs of discontent. I share your concerns. We are trained for espionage. We would be legends. But the records are sealed. Glorying in battle is not our way. Think of our heroes. A silent step. He just He's slides nation, around, watch. Single shot. Or the ever alert who kept armies at bay with hidden facts. These giants do not seem to give us solace here, but they are not all that we are. Before the network, there was the fleet. Before diplomacy, there were soldiers. Our influence stopped Arachni, but before that, we held the line. Our influence stopped the Krogan, but before that, 
We held the line. My eye kind of itches and it feels like there's something in my eye, but Our I don't want to scratch it because staring. it may seem like... I always today, hesitate to do that. Every time certain stuff is happening line. or something is going on, I don't want to make it seem like I'm crying because I'm not. Good luck, Commander. But I yeah, there's something in my eye. Literally, I'm not kidding. You want to try and see if there's any... Do you want my face? Look, man. Anything? I don't feel anything. It's all dry to me. So, yeah. Alright. We're nearing the end of this video. I'm surprised. I don't think it should have taken this long, honestly. Oh. Well, I did start this at the beginning. So it makes sense. It makes sense. So, actually, I've progressed pretty far, honestly. So, Rex and... Um... Garrus. And I know what I'm upgrading Garrus with. Alright. Here we go. Com check. Do you read me, Commander? Affirmative. Loud and clear. Good. We'll start our push. We'll try to make it to the AA guns, but it might be up to you to finish the job. Alright. Commander, if you see any way to undermine their defenses, we could definitely use the help. Alright. Will do. Yep, I know. And I know just the ways to help them. No. And here we go. Uh, put a point into warp. It increases your warp. And... Last, but not a least. We are going to put a point in here. Not a point in here. But I, I, it's already for me. Or, I mean, Garrus. Uh, this, you only have 3.5. With 19 reduction and cooldown. There you go. And you got some uh, armor protection stuff. Alright. Uh, I am going to pause and save and end it here. Alright. Thank you so much for watching. And I will see you. And you will see a me in the next video. Hello everybody, this is Critical Annihilation and I'm Fuck boy, bitch. Guarantee that shit. You gotta stop my motherfucking dead you I'll leave that in too.